good morning. Uh, sorry about that interruption. I had accidentally scheduled something on top of this session. Yay! I haven't had time to check the um, reason that the uh, streaming software does not appear to be picking up the game audio. I'll have to try to figure that out later. Um, I'm currently trying to start the game, um, and I'm using scenes in uh, OBS Studio to uh, provide a little bit more context to what's going on if I have to start a slow starting game or um, have to pause or something. Um, just trying to leverage a little bit more useful stuff in OBS Studio scenes and so on. Uh, but I'm still getting a sense of it, so I hope you'll excuse the fact that I haven't figured some stuff out. I did, however, um, reinstall the captioning plugin, and that seems to be working properly. So cross fingers that it keeps working. <laughs> um, I saw some interesting demo. Oh, now apparently I am getting some sound. I don't know. Anyway, we'll see on the on the on the Twitch recording. I'll I'll look and see if it's working, and if it's not, I will try to fix it. Um, but let's get started. All right, that is the scene that we're more used to. Let me get my controller. Okay. So I hear the desktop audio, but uh, OBS Studio doesn't appear to be. You know what? I'm just going to mess with it just a little bit. Um, and see if I can. Figure that out. Because I think it's actually. There it is, desktop. That one. Feel like something sort of stuck. Yeah, there's something about the settings. that they're not appearing to work. Um, desktop audio. Yeah, yeah, I'm not, I'm not figuring this out quickly, so I guess I will leave it to future Malcolm to figure it out, and I'll apologize for not having the sound as far as I can tell. All right, and then this, of course, is not doing anything. Nope, okay. Check this. Filters, properties. No, all right, well, we'll see. I guess the other question is, is it maybe actually working and I just can't see it? Because when I minimize the display, or, oh yeah, it is working. I think it's just that I'm paranoid about it and I can't see it working. So I'm, I don't, I don't believe that it's working, but I think it actually is. So I'll try to stop cutting in and out of the audio and just play the dang game. <clears throat> Uh, 
Okay. So around the mini-map, we can see that there's just a huge number of things left to do. Um, I do need to get those hard drives. So let's try to get those hard drives. Oh, I see it. Okay, wait a minute. I'm trying to find out how to get to the crossing road. And I think the issue is that it's actually, yeah, I am above it. There we go. That was a messy way to get on that freeway. I'll just get out in the middle of the road. That's always the best, right? So it's up here. I guess the question is, can I actually just... Yeah, okay. So it's behind this. Oh, is it, it's even further up, okay. There it is. Nice. All right, so I have to go around town getting these hard drives, which is silly, but I can also do other things at the same time. So there's a QR code here. Actually, let's just run the route here and hit everything we can. I don't know. Okay, so that only got me so far. Okay, um, and now I'm lost. That goes, that does not help me. There we go. Alrighty. I'm going to go for that question mark. Can I go over here? Yes. Usually you can't go over fences that have um, spikes, but these do not have spikes, so I think that they were okay.
don't know. Ooh, a ring. Okay. Um, that hard drive actually, that one looks better. And I left my truck in the middle of the road somewhere. Did I? Now I can't find the dang thing. All right, let's just run. I do need a system key, thank you. Where am I going? I feel like I'm going further than I want to just run. So let's pick up a junky sports car. I mean, that's not terrible. Yes, I will break by running into someone. That sounds like a great idea. Where am I going? Oh, I'm going to up to this hard drive over here. I feel like I've been here before. Does that seem familiar to you? It's familiar to me. All right. Do I have any better car choices? I have the same car choices. Wow, this is a really nasty looking sports car, but I guess it'll do, right? It's a good thing that I have a terrible turning radius so that I can run into as many things as possible. Alright, there's a check-in place. Where's the hot button? There it is. Boop. Okay, and then the, there's actually, let's do the intrusion first. Oh, irritating, okay. I think I can go up here. Protector. Oh, and I need a protector up here. There's a nicer sports car. I should remember that. Okay. Wait until you're 50. Wow, this has been a festival of inappropriate choices involving family members. 
All right, so I want to go to the thing that's to my right, roughly. I think, okay, so it's up there. So the question is, can I get up there or can I see up there? I'm going to go around the back and see if I can actually get up on this structure. Yep, oh, lift. It was sunny, now it is raining. The lifts are much more complicated in Watch Dogs 2. These are just on off and Watch Dogs 2, you, I think you control it going up, down, and where it stops. Okay, let's see about this QR code. Oh, I'm almost where I need to be. I think there must be a camera here. Almost, just slightly off. So I think it's, where is it? This one? That seems unlikely. Yeah, that is unlikely. Okay. So that was the one I had. I feel like it should be That's too far off. Can't even see it. Okay. All right, so I think maybe it's further back. Got an explodey thing. That's the lift. No, it needs to be kind of. That's just not it. It's like it needs to be right next to this, though. Like, oh, that one. Do I? There we go. Okay, so that mystery continues to develop. Is there anything up here that I want? Oh, there's another investigation. I guess the question is, is there another hard drive? Is that the only one? No, there's one right here. And there, there's three of them in Pawnee. All right, let's go to Pawnee. Because I think I got all the ones in this sector. Yeah, I didn't get everything of everything, but I got all of those. So yeah, let's go to Pawnee. So we'll need a car. All right, so let's take the lift. There's a nice, reasonably nice car down there. I think it's one of those dented sports cars, but you know, beggars can't be choosers. Oh, it's not too dented. That one actually looks pretty nice. Not as nice as that rainbow colored thing we saw in the other part of town, but it's pretty good. 
Oh, yeah, it's got a little pickup on it. Seems like it's reckless to drive this fast in the rain. Hey now. What is this thing? Oh, that's a remember icon. Let's go to the remember. I think I ran over that guy's foot. I don't know if I need to. Did I? Didn't I already do this? I thought I already did a remember here. Well, let's see what happens. It's probably the same one that I maybe I didn't save it last time. I don't know. Yeah, I remember doing this one. I'm gonna skip it. Skipping. See if it's still yeah, the car's still there. Ooh, a system key. You need those for jamming comms. All right, what am I doing? I do not want to drive through the pedestrian zone, although it is raining pretty heavily. Maybe there's not that many pedestrians. I'll just do a 75 point turn. Try not to run this person over. Try not to get in an accident. Not stopping at a critical junction, because, you know, that's the kind of driver I am. It's a wonder that I got a driver's license a month ago. Like a real one. Not a, you know, watchdog's driver's license. Nobody cares about that anyway. Aiden Pierce has a driver's license. Of course he does. Besides, who needs a driver's license for driving illegally like a dick? I wish you could get the um, modified viewpoint to stick, but unfortunately, like when you're going over crests of hills and stuff like that, the game recenters your view and then you lose the whatever modifications you did on the on the view and you have to reset it again if you feel like you need the extra visibility which i think is silly but i guess that's just the way it's going to be oh Okay, maybe I should have gone up there anyway. Because the thing is, all right, let's go this way. Ooh, it's dark. The thing is, there was something up here already. The QR code, maybe that was, yeah, the QR code's up here too. So I think we'll try to do both. But this one first. Scary, lightning -y, dark, mountain, forest trail, BS. See Bigfoot around here and freak myself out. All right. <clears throat> and the QR code is there. I will have to steal another car. Also, I don't want to fall down a cliff. 
falling down a cliff would be bad. So let's not do that. So that indicates that the QR code is somewhere around here, or that you can see it from basically the middle of the road where you can get run over for your troubles. Do you see anything? Oh, there it is. All right. Uh, so I think you always have to see it through a camera. And so the question is, where's the damn camera? It looks to me like it's, oh, that's only part of it. It's not too stretched out, though. So what's covering? That's what I don't get. All right. Yeah, that's half. So it's, no, let's look at it from here. Yeah, I think it's I think it's over here. Let me get it. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's on the other side of the billboard, of course. You keep talking. This is across this bridge. We're gonna hope this is not occupied with a. With an occupying force. I feel like this at some times is occupied by an occupying force, but I don't think it is right now, so I'm just gonna go for it. Really over there? Okay. We'll get in the elevator. I'm sure that it's safe. Does not feel safe, but whatever. Okay. Still trying to get over there. Feel like oh crane, yeah. I definitely feel like there's a firefight that happens here. I feel like I remember it from an earlier playthrough, but it seems like it's not occupied right now, so it should be safe to get this hard drive right now. And why else would you have all these explosives? There it is. Okay. And then there was another hard drive here. I think, was that the only, was it only three? I think it was. Yeah. All right, so I just need to find my way to a road, steal a vehicle. Maybe not even a road. Maybe just this thing. This thing looks terrible. Who would drive this? Oh, they would drive it because it's off-road. Yep. Okay. And because that's what you drive in Pawnee. Or whatever the hell this is. It looks like Pawnee is actually to our left. Ah. Uh. Probably shouldn't be driving this fast in this vehicle because apparently it has a very poor turning radius. <clears throat> Very poor. Oh, and this is a check in area, too. What's what? Where's the hotspot?
Okay, and somehow I checked in even though I couldn't find the hotspot. Okay. What else? I could buy explosives. Oh yeah, let's go to the store. We can get drugs and explosives. We'll just get back in the truck that we parked in the middle of the road because that's the kind of person we are. This person needs to know how to walk around in the county without getting freaked out and getting run over. Oh, that's right. You get the explosives at the pawn shop where it makes sense to buy explosives. Hello. Ooh, yeah. Okay. Unstable component. Yes. All right. So that was well worth it. What else can we buy? Drugs. Yes. I know there's a, um, fire fight in this neck of the woods, because I know that later in the game, you have to come out here to confront some military types. Loads of fun, especially if you've got all the hacks to control all the various hackable city components. Hello. I've already got the meds I need. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we can go to, let's go to the gun store. Let's build this one. I like it. Oh, no, let's steal a motorcycle. It's much more practical around here. Ooh, new vehicle. This is a dirt bike. These people need to settle down. I'm not going to run them over. With that, I steal your money. <laughs> Ooh, over 100,000. Nice job. Okay. Now I can buy that ATSG I always wanted. You know it. All right. Scrolling down, got that, yep, first fire machine pistol, do I need that? It's only 800, I may as well. All right, uh, it looks like, oh, first fire assault, I mean to complete the collection. Oh, and there was... Full auto assault rifle, 30,000. You got it. Okay. Um, now I can. Oh, I don't need. I guess I have the pump action grenade launcher already. Can I get the R? I can get the D50. I can even afford the M8M. Let's get the M8M. 
All right, now I have hardly any money comparatively, so let's stop buying weapons and go about our business. And I don't think I can buy like vests. No, I think this is all the sort of like flavor. Like in GTA, you can go into a gun store and buy bulletproof vests, which helps your overall survivability the next time you get into your frequent firefight fights. Okay, um, I don't know. Let's go do the thing. Let's go do the, let's go do the, um, campaign. Let's fast travel and go do the next campaign. Alright, so I fast traveled and now I have no car. Let's go out into the world from our alleyway and find a car. There's some cars. They look like decent cars. We'll get a hot hatch. We love hot hatches. It's not a very hot hot hatch, but it's a, you know, hatchback. Looks like a Fiat C500. This thing sounds like a vacuum cleaner. Who buys cars that sound like vacuum cleaners? Well, people like me traditionally. The only reason I know to call something a hot hatch is because I've been watching too much Top Gear, which I watch, by the way, for the idiocy and not the cars. I mean, I guess the cars are somewhat interesting, but they're not the primary objective for me. I just want to see three guys being idiots with each other. That's the entertaining part. Checked in. Start the mission. So I guess what, do I run around and cause trouble until somebody arrests me? Or do I just break into the correctional center to start acting like a prisoner? That's the only, I just walk through a metal detector with a pistol and they arrest me? That's great. You're going to find my 17 other weapons? No, I just went in with a pistol. Good lord, people. That's outrageous. All right, so I need to get over there and hack that. I might be able to do it through these guys' cameras. I can't remember. Looks like maybe. Let's go get her. Oh, not quite, huh? I jumped too soon. Yeah, that was, I was hoping to catch that guard who had a camera, but let's catch this one instead. All right, uh, ooh, that's nice. Okay.
And I can't actually exit out of this camera hopping, so I just need to find the right person with the correct angle. Oh, that's me. <laughs> mm. I want that guy. How do I get that guy? If I don't get that guy? Oh, I need to get that guy. understand why there would be a whole patrol area completely unguarded. <laughs> I'm just going to go for it. It's saying down. Why is it saying down?
<clears throat> Not really inclined to say anything while I'm sneaking around. All right, turn your back, buddy. What do I need to do? Wonder if there's anything I can Oh, it's in there. It's in here. So that
Oh, look, it's me. I want that skill. Did I not? See you.
What is our progression award then? Three points. Let's get that transformer. We got a lot of heat. It's so irritating. Um, do I want to? I feel like I've played enough this morning. I think I'm going to stop. And I will join you again. And hopefully you like the new um, changes. And if you don't, let me know. And I'll consider making it better or worse, depending on, on your aesthetics. But anyway. Thank you for joining me. Um, it's the start of a new week. Uh, I hope that you can take care of your family and they will take care of you, both humans and furry, or scaly or feathery or shelled or whatever your pets are like if you have them. Take good care of yourself and I'll see you again. Oh, and I forgot to show you my farewell screen, which is not finished, but here it is. And it sort of requires, well, first of all, it's things are the wrong size for reasons I don't understand. I'm sure I'll figure it out and learn it later. Um, but in the upper right, I hope to have um, a montage of recent clips or something, depending on what I have time to uh, assemble. Um, anyway, take good care of yourself, and I will see you again. Bye-bye.